Hi, I'm Henry Rollins, and this is Mr. Jerry Lee Lewis, and we are your hosts tonight for the next 120 minutes on MTV. Tonight, we've got brand new videos from Sponge, Babes in Toyland, and The Bad Brains. And in one hour, it's the MTV premiere of the Beastie Boys' new one for a song called Root Down. So to kick things off, here's an MTV premiere from Soul Asylum. And as you well know, the Minneapolis band is going to be uh, dropping this record real soon. Their last one sold three million copies. That one is called Grave Dancers Union, which I'm sure you know very well. Anyway, on June 6th, the new album uh, comes out, and it's called Let Your Dim Light Shine. This is the first Soul Asylum album to feature the new drummer Sterling Campbell. And here's the first video off it, and the song is called Misery. Every day, uh, the songs will take on different aspects for us because we're in different situations and a song that you maybe write a year ago or three days ago uh, might be different when you're within a different situation. With the second video off their gold debut album 16 Stone, that's the Oxford England band Bush with Little Things here on 120 Minutes. I'm Henry Rollins and this is Jerry Lee Lewis and we are guest hosting uh, the show tonight. And uh, Jerry, you recorded your first album in 12 years recently, and it's uh, coming out real soon. Yes, uh, it's been 12 years since I've done any recording, Hank, and uh, we've got high hopes for this album, Young Blood. You, you, have, you have fun recording it? Oh, I had a ball, yeah. It, it was good to get Paley. back in the studio. Mm -hmm. It was different, but a lot of fun. Yeah, okay. Well, uh, we're going to get a look at the uh, first video off this album and the song is called Goosebumps but that's not for a while so I want you to stay with us and uh, we're gonna roll that in a little while anyway coming up at one o'clock we'll have the MTV premiere of the new Beastie Boys video Root Down but first it's the Long Beach California punk reggae band Sublime with the first video off their debut album 40 ounces to freedom that's really inventive the song is called Date Ray please stay tuned We've got a video coming up from Bad Religion, plus uh, one from a hardcore band called No Use For A Name, and an MTV premiere from the Beastie Boys here on 120 Minutes. I'm Henry Rollins, and this is Mr. Jerry Lee Lewis, and uh, we are your guest hosts tonight. Um, a thing that I always thought was interesting is uh, I've been making records for a long time, not as long as you. I've always been in a situation where I was able to redo a vocal if I messed one up or if the guitar player broke a string, he mm -hmm. could just come back on another day and do the guitar over. But when you were making records early on, uh, it was basically all live and you just had to get it right. What, what's that like compared to how, you're, how you made your last record where it was a, a, you know, a more modern studio? Well, it's so different now, Hank, because back when I first started recording back in 1956 and um, we didn't do overdubbing and believe it or not all my hit records were just one take and that was it it was, going, it was a full track machine wow. Sun Records on 706 Union Avenue in Memphis and I'd just go in we'd done great balls of fire like pit, that was it and there was no overdubbing but now it's different it's they overdub now yeah, and there's a lot, you know, they, they go, okay, you're going to make your record, we'll, get, we'll be working for two months, and you used to just do it in one hour, right? Yeah, that, that's, I used to record, uh, all my big albums were not over two, two and a half hours. In the studio working? In the studio, the whole deal, that was it. Well, well things are different now. Anyway, uh, next up is Boston. No! It's uh, Boston-based songwriter uh, Jennifer Trinan, and this is her debut full-length album. It's called Cockamamie, and the first video off it is called Happier. <laughs> From their fourth album, Leche Con Carne, that's the California band called No Use For A Name with Soulmate here on 120 Minutes. I'm Henry Rollins. This is Mr. Jerry Lee Lewis, and we are your hosts tonight. Um, I just wanted to talk briefly about, you know, geographically and a little bit historically where you come from musically. You recorded a lot of your early stuff in Memphis, Tennessee, and uh, at Sun Studios uh -huh. uh, under uh, uh -huh. uh, the supervision of Mr. F Sam Phillips. And there's this a great camaraderie amongst musicians back in those days that I find lacking these days. There's a lot more cutthroat nature amongst musicians. and. Uh, there was a really great event 
uh, which later called the the uh, million dollar quartet, mm -hmm. uh, where you and Johnny Cash and Carl Perkins oh, and right. Elvis Presley got together and recorded a bunch of songs, standards and spirituals. Yeah. And maybe you could tell us something about that, you know, sure, that day and how, how it came about. It was uh, um, a Carl Perkins session. He was recording that day. And uh, Mr. Phillips came out and told me, he said, Elvis had called down and would like to come down and meet me. He had never met me before when he was coming down and meeting me. And I, I never met him. It was great, you know. So he came down and um, I let Carl maybe cut one song. And Elvis came in. That was the end of the session. So we started laughing, talking, shooting a bull, carrying on. And uh, singing and everything. And Johnny started singing with us. Carl started singing. And eventually they faded out. Me and Elvis sang for hours. And it's all on tape? All of it. Sam Phillips recorded it himself. I saw him. Yeah, and uh, and and that uh, some of that session is out. It's it's available. You can buy it. You can, it's been out for years. They've uh, bootlegged the album for years and years, and uh, sure, and they sold millions of them. And and I, the kids, when they listen to this album, and that uh, I played it at the house for some kids before, and they say, "Who?" I said, "That's Elvis Presley and me singing." They say, "Oh, you got to be joking." And they, they well, it is pretty really unbelievable, know you know. But then you see there's some really famous shots because I know Sam Phillips sent the, sent uh, a word out to some of the press people locally, and they came down. He, he sent everything out except any money. He never sent no money out. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I heard about that. Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> at the top of the hour, we're going to have the MTV premiere of the new Beastie Boys video called uh, "Root Down." And right after the break, it's the Hoboken band, uh, Hoboken, New Jersey band called Yola Tango. First, here's a look at the top 10 albums on the alternative radio chart this week. This is the first proper uh, rock or music video you've ever done. Mm, this is it. So uh, tell me a little bit about what it was like uh, taking orders all day. <laughs> well, it was really, uh, it was, I didn't know what to do. What, I didn't know what to think about it. I, I went in and um, I missed the first day. I was real sick, and they didn't believe that. So I told them that I was, and I made it up the next day. I got there, and we actually uh, worked 12 hours straight on this video. And uh, Jesus, I I thought maybe I should go back to the farm. <laughs> but I've never worked that hard in my life. But I'm very proud of it, Hank, and it, uh, it looks real good. good. Yeah, I okay. think. Good. Yeah. yeah. Well, we're going to see it real soon. Uh, Jerry's record comes out on May 23rd, which is this coming Tuesday. And uh, you know who this is, and you know who I am, and we are guest hosting 120 Minutes tonight. And right here, right now, it's the Hoboken, New Jersey trio, Yolo Tango, with their first video off their seventh album, Electro Pura. It's called Tom Courtenay. Couldn't go out consider myself a lyricist That's all. I mean, I think I think like, what, what I've written's all right, but I wouldn't like put it against John Lennon or or Kurt Cobain or Morrissey or anything like that. I mean, that's for other people to say. I don't particularly think the, our lyrics are that good, to tell you the truth, or my lyrics are that good. I think they I think they sound pretty stupid, but that's just the way it is, you know. With the third video off their gold debut album, Definitely Maybe, that's the Manchester, England band Oasis with their song Rock and Roll Star here on 120 Minutes. I'm Henry Rollins, and this is Mr. Jerry Lee Lewis, and we are your guest hosts tonight. Um, as I remember, historically, your father bought you a piano when you were eight years old. It's still in your house in Mississippi. I saw it myself. That's right. And um, what, what did you like... Uh, when you first sat down to start playing it, you know, I don't know exactly what your father had in mind, but I know you, you kind of uh, immediately went to you know, Boogie Woogie and, and, and the music. Uh, well, the, the point I wanted to make is there's two songs that, that I know that you grew up learning how to play piano to, House of Blue Light and, and Down the Road a Piece, right. that you actually That's did right. on this right. album, which is really great. And I, maybe uh, you can tell us about what it was like when you first sat down at the piano and what, what made you like it. And, well, my folks bought me this piano. They mortgaged the house and bought it for me. And it was an old upright piano, but it was like brand new back then. And um, I was right at home. I sat down and uh, I started tinkering around with it. And, in, and within two weeks, I, I was playing pretty good piano. And uh, down the road, a piece was 
a very simple song to play anyway. Mm -hmm. So I kind of liked that one, and I got into that one pretty good, and House of Blue Lights. I learned all these songs on at Haynes' Big House there in Faraday. That's right. Mm -hmm. And um, when, I remember that uh, you told me that your dad used to take you and the piano on the flatbed truck, and you go play in churches and stuff for people. How, how many... How many months had you been playing before you went out in front of people, do you think? Oh, we would play anywhere anybody would listen to us. <laughs> right, but, but how, many, how long have you been playing before you went out in front of people? Oh, about, uh, about three months. Wow. And you were eight years old playing in front of, uh, playing on Sundays for people? Yeah, the little fingers. My, my hand was very small. My fingers are still small, but uh, I get over pretty good, you know. And uh, I know it sounds uh, kind of fishy, that a person could learn how to play a piano and teach himself to do it at the age of eight years old. But I did. Yeah, that nice. happened to me. And uh, I don't think people believe that, but I swear it's the truth. I believe you. And obviously you got it. Anyway. I'm, st I'm still learning, as a matter of fact. I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, you, as a musician, you aspire to grow. In less than <laughs> 10 minutes, we'll have the MTV premiere of the new Beastie Boys video, Root Down. And right after the break, okay, the break, that's where they run a bunch of commercials. And that's where you should, like, break for the refrigerator. Anyway, it's an oldie from, uh, <laughs> it's the first video I ever did for the uh, Rollins band. And uh, please stick around so you can see it. It's back when I was young and very handsome. Oh yeah, what's up? This is Mike D from the Beastie Boys, and you're watching 120 Minutes on MTV. We're just five minutes away from the MTV premiere of the new Beastie Boys video, Root Down. I can't wait to see this, because all I've been doing is sitting here all evening in the wonderful uh, MTV building here in Miami Beach talking about it. Anyway, I'm Henry Rollins. And uh, my guest host with me is Mr. Jerry Lee Lewis. And um, I know this time when you did the record, you used a lot more musicians on it than you probably ever used uh, in quite a while. I'm not talking about string sections or anything. I'm talking about real, real players and you know right. everything. And uh, so I know you used to work with just you know bass player, drummer, and guitar player. But there's two, two or three musicians on this record I think are very important to talk about. And and one of them is is your uh, guitar player who you've had with you playing with you for, for decades, and uh, let's talk Ken, about him. Kenny Lovelace, yeah. right. uh, he's, uh, he lives in Nashville, Tennessee. He uh, is one of the, the better guitar players in the country, and violinist too. He's a concert violin player, and he plays fiddle too, you know. But um, James Burton played guitar on the, uh, on the session with me too. He was Elvis's guitar player for 12 years. And did he cut any of the, uh, uh, any really important singles for Elvis? Yes, he did. Yeah, several. Right, and so uh, so he's on the record as well. Yeah. The thing, I, one of the, my favorite things on the record is, uh, I, I I hope I don't have the 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 instrument wrong. Is it either la is it a lap steel, or now a pedal they, steel that that kind of Hank Williams? They overdubbed that on. The, I don't I don't know who the steel player was. But, but what, what's the what's the instrument? Is it a lap steel, or it's, a pedal steel? It, it sounds like a, a, a an old. Still get taught like Hank Williams used to use. Right? Okay, because yeah, that's that's that that feel it gives, and it's it's on a few songs on the record. And I really like it. It is good. Andy yeah. Payne is good on that kind of stuff. Yeah, yeah, it was a really really nice nice overdub. Mm -hmm. You know, <laughs> a great overdub, babe. <laughs> anyway, a great overdub, really. Yeah, no, it, it, it proves it, something to me. Yeah, definitely. Uh, and right now, it's an older video for me and my worthy constituents, the <laughs> Rollins Band, and this video is filmed by. Uh, Avant video director, singer of R.E.M., Mr. Michael Stipe, and it's a song off our uh, debut album, uh, record-breaking, okay, forget it. The album was called Lifetime. We did it a few years ago for $3,200, and um, it was done with Michael Stipe running around a small club in Athens, Georgia, with a handheld black and white camera with his baseball cap on backwards. And every single time I'd look down, I'm singing away, and I look down, and there's Michael looking up at me with a camera, getting, having kids falling all over him, and it was hilarious. Anyway, it was his idea, and the song is called What Am I Doing Here, and it was a, it was a great moment of my life. Okay. <laughs> 
I'm Henry Rollins, and this is Mr. Jerry Lee Lewis, and we are your guest hosts tonight for the second half of MTV's 120 Minutes. We are past the 50-yard line and running down for the big touchdown at the end of the show. Anyway, we've got alternative music video from Sponge, Shudder to Think, Babes in Toyland, Catherine Wheel, Bad Brains, Bjork, Sugar Ray, Radiohead, and lots more. First up, as promised, it's an MTV premiere from the Beastie Boys. This is the third video off their fourth album called Ill Communication. The song is called Root Down. I know you've been waiting to see it, and let it roll. With a second video off their fifth album, Pony Express Record, that's the DC bass band Shudder to Think, with the song X French T-shirt here on good old 120 minutes. I'm Henry Rollins, this is Mr. Jerry Lee Lewis, and we are guest hosting tonight. So, um, I'll, I think it's important to note that uh, you were the first guy in rock and roll who had your piano up at the front of the stage, where like the piano was the main thing, not the guitar. All right. And uh, not the not the singer just standing alone with a microphone. So tell us. The like, secret you know, was you had to be able to hear the piano. Right. So tell us how you did that. Well, I used a a violin pickup. They use on violins, make right. them real loud. And you take it and put it in the back of a a, a piano, and you put it in there with pasteboard. It has to be put in there a, sec, sec, a very special way, and hook it up in a Fender amplifier, and you can have fifteen thousand people, and you can burst the eardrums with it. And I had a boy on bass who was playing electric bass, one of the first ones that they ever made, the Fender, Fender bass. We got the second one made. And uh, my drummer was playing, and that's all we had. That's all we needed. And, but this is some of the first uh, electric rock music ever played. Because, you know, I know you grew up just, you know, playing in, in you know, churches and... and uh, yeah, well, nobody ever heard and, of this pickup before. Right. I didn't know how to do that. A, a blind man taught me how to do that in Natchez, Mississippi, when I worked at the uh, Wagon Wheel in Natchez, Mississippi. Right? And, and how did, uh, how, what did the crowd think of being able to hear something real loud like that? They, they really liked it? They loved it. They've never heard Yelling and screaming? Like it. Yeah, they couldn't believe it. Uh, I, I knew it would be great if I could ever get it across. You know? Right, and you did? I did, yeah. Cool. Uh, next up, it's the Detroit uh, band Sponge with their second video off their debut album Rotting Pinata. The song is called Molly. We've got Bjork's new video coming up along with the LA band Sugar Ray and a brand new one from Babes in Toyland here on 120 Minutes. I'm Henry Rollins and this is Mr. Jerry Lee Lewis and we are your guest host tonight. Um, I think it's, it's important to note that uh, ever since you started playing in front of people in the 50s You've been uh, playing at least 100 shows a year all over the world mm -hmm. for decades, and this year's no different. You're going out, uh, right. and you're, uh, so the tour starts in Europe for this year? Uh, next month, right. You go out for Europe for a, a, long, a long tour? Uh, yeah, we're going to be over for about two and a half months. Okay, and then you're going to come back to America after that and do, do some shows? Yes, we'll be working uh, a lot of the summer uh, here in, in the States, yeah. Uh -huh. Are you, are you going to play into the fall, or... Uh, I yeah. guess we'll be playing right up, to, right probably until Christmas break or something. Yeah, we always work right up until Christmas. Okay, yeah, we usually do. Yeah. Cool. Well, if y'all uh, see his name uh, somewhere, you should go because it's a, a night of the real thing. Anywhere, uh, right here, it's uh, the Catherine Wheel. This is the uh, first video off their third album, Happy Days, and it's called Way Down. <laughs> we're the first video off their debut album Lemonade and Brownies that's the LA band Sugar Ray with the song Mean Machine here on 120 Minutes I'm Henry Rollins this is Jerry Lee Lewis and we're guest hosting tonight uh, please stick around with us because uh, we're going to be playing the latest latest, uh, the, latest <laughs> the latest from Radiohead plus a brand new one from the original Bad Brains lineup and right after the break uh, will be a brand new one from Babes in Toyland. Uh, if I were you, I would check that record out. I heard it uh, a while ago, and it's amazing. Anyway, uh, we are going to continue here, me and Mr. Lewis, here on 120 Minutes, so please stay tuned. Thanks. Hi, we're uh, from Radiohead. I'm Tom. He's Ed. And you're watching 120 Minutes on MTV. We 
we've got the latest from radio <laughs> coming up. I don't know what it is. This show fills me with such inner light, mirth, and joy. I can't help but laugh. But it's not a scornful laugh. It's a laugh of radiant joy. Anyway, speaking of radiant joy, it's Radiohead coming up with a brand new video from... Uh, Okay, um, I'm still going to save this. Anyway, we have a brand new video from the Bad Brains here in 120 Minutes. My name is Mr. Ern, <coughs> and this is Mr. Jerry Lee Lewis, and we are guest hosting tonight. Um, I think, uh, I think it's, it's not a good idea that we have to wait 12 years every time for you to make a record. So yes, that would be bad because... Well, this time we we've done two albums anyway. When we have done this one. Oh yeah. Okay. You know, so yeah. so maybe in the next couple of years we'll get we'll get another Jerry Lee Lewis album. And we won't have to wait a decade plus. I would hope in six or seven months. I don't think they're gonna let you know. See, that's another thing that's different about the record industry these days. Remember back in the old days, you, mean you could they don't do release like, one like that anymore. No, you could do like two or three <laughs> albums in a year. Yeah. Well, they don't do that anymore. You'll definitely oh. be waiting at least a year and a half, two years. Well, I can see the world that would be good. Yeah. You know, th they want a, a chance to you know, properly promote all the other ones and probably drag you back down here to old MTV again at some point. That would be an honor. But uh, really? you never know. But um, so a year I, between albums? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, man. Uh, well, it's been uh, it's been a long time since I released one, just because I've been working so hard trying to write new songs for it. So it's. Mine uh, don't sound like it could be more than that, could it? Well, you know, who knows? <laughs> we might be both, you know, no, mowing lawns out, I don't know. with uh, with some of the illustrious MTV staff. Anyway, um, <laughs> right now it's a brand new video from Babes in Toyland. This is their fourth album, Nemesis Sisters. And this, uh, this record has three covers on it, uh, cover songs. And uh, one of which is uh, Eric Carmen's 70s hit, All By Myself, uh, a song by Billie Holiday called Deep Song, and Sister Sledge's We Are Family. And this is the first video off the album. It's, uh, it's a song called Sweet 69, and here it is. This is Peter Murphy, and you're watching 120 Minutes. Be sure to check out 120 Minutes next Sunday at midnight and 11 Central when ex-Bauhaus singer Peter Murphy will be combing his hair strangely, sucking in his cheekbones, and nearly dying of malnutrition here as a guest on MTV's 120 Minutes. Only kidding, he's a great artist, and we have the same management, so I better <coughs> not make any jokes. Anyway, I'm Henry Rollins, and uh, this is Mr. Jerry Lee Lewis, and we have been guest hosting tonight. Um, you're going to be doing some shows this summer uh, with Mr. Van Morrison, another musician of great renown. Right. And uh, how, do you know how many dates you're doing together in Europe? Uh, approximately, I think, about three weeks. Oh, three weeks together as a co-headline. That's great. Not every night. That'll just be like three nights off, a couple of nights, and then four nights right. off. I understand. Okay. And um, I just found this out that you have a, there's a new biography that's been written about you called The Killer. Right. And it's coming out here in America uh, later on in the year. Uh, that's right. It's out in Europe now. Right. And it'll be coming out here in America yeah. real soon. They named the book The right. Killer. I, I didn't name it that. They did. Do you like the book? I love the book. The book tells the truth. Okay. It's the only one that's really truthful. Because there's been a lot written about you. and. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of disappointing books out there that don't tell the truth. They don't. But this one does. This does so if someone wanted truth, to learn about you and where right. you came from and everything, this is the book well, to I check out. I had a thorough understanding with the man. I talked with him uh, for eight months. I eyeballed him. And I told him this had to be right. And everything in it's right. Okay. Well, we'll be looking for it. Uh, the final video on 120 Minutes Tonight is from the DC band Bad Brains. Uh, just so you know, this is uh, one of the first bands I ever saw up close. I used to go see arena rock bands way back in the days, and uh, then one night I got to see the Bad Brains play at a house party, and they were right in front of me and had a huge impact on me. Anyway, the original lineup is intact with H.R. singing, and uh, Daryl Jennifer and um, Earl Hudson and uh, Gary on guitar, and they're back together. They have a new album called uh, God of Love. It's on Maverick, and this is the first video off it, and the... Uh, it's, on, it's the title track, God of Love, and here it is. Bad Brains there with God of Love, and the final video on 120 Minutes tonight. Uh, if you have any comments, suggestions, 
or uh, reasons that why this station should be in existence, and you want to, or if you have any cult classic requests like those fantastic Duran Duran videos or those breakthrough Pat Benatar videos that they made about 175 years ago, please send those requests, comments, or suggestions into 15 15 Broad. <laughs> I'll do it. 15 15 Broadway, 24th floor, New York, New York, and the zip code is 10036. And please, and I'm really serious now, please uh, check out 120 Minutes next Sunday, uh, midnight, 11 Central, when we're going to have Peter Murphy will be the guest, and um, he'll be performing live. I'm Henry Rollins. This is Mr. Jerry Lee Lewis. We've been your hosts uh, for tonight. Mr. Lewis? Yes, sir. Always an honor, sir. Thank you, Hank. He just broke my hand. <laughs> <laughs> As I uh, want you to remember that Jerry's album, Youngblood, comes out on the 23rd of this month. That's this Tuesday.